Okay. Well, I'm very tired, but I'm gonna do one more, maybe more. Um, the next one is Robin Hood. You can probably even see that down a little bit there. Robin Hood, Robin Hood, Robin Hood. Um, this is the 40th anniversary. It's four years old. So 44 years old. Um, this Robin Hood may be my favorite Robin Hood. I love Men and Tights, and uh, I really did like the Russell Crowe one. But um, this one's been my favorite since I was a little kid. I might have had a giant crush on Robin. I know. People get it. Like, it's embarrassing, remember? But as a little kid, you get crushes on weird creatures because all you watch are like cartoons and animal crap. Didn't have crushes on animals, but like animal more animals, like people animals, stuff, and cartoons. If you didn't have a crush on a cartoon, boy or girl, you're lying. Um, like who didn't have a crush on Jessica Rabbit, and still does. She's hot. Um, but this is like a simple Robin Hood's tale. Like he's been doing it a while. Prince John, not Prince John, Prince. Yeah, Prince John. There's two Johns in this. Why am I just remembering? I'm very tired. He's a baby, though. Like, they make him kind of babyish. There he is. And, uh, he sucks his thumb, and his, uh, his, uh, sidekick is really funny. Um, is Sir Hiss. Um, there's the Sheriff of Nottingham, um, who is a wolf, who... As I talked about, I talked about him in, um, the Rest of the Cats video. I'm trying to find it. There we go. 1973. Okay. Um, who is the Sheriff of Rodenham? Pat Bertram. Um, who's the dog of the two dogs, um, in the Rest of the Cats? Because I'm leader. I say when we do whatever he's gonna say. Um, he plays the sheriff of um, Nottingham. I always want to say Rottingham. I've watched Menatites way too much. Robin Hood Menatites. Um, this guy is the third, and I think there's another one, but I don't know if I've, I've noticed it. Um, Phil Harris. I don't know if he ever did another um, Disney movie. Because he, uh, Rock-A-Doodle, but I didn't watch that. I don't know what Rock-A-Doodle is. But the three main ones he did that I just hear him, he's a very, very soothing voice to me. Is uh, Jungle Book as Baloo, which is probably his most famous. And then he's Thomas O'Malley um, in Aristocrats. And he's Little John in Rodden. So he plays two bears. Um, so that's pretty cool. Uh, my voice is tired. This, um, where are you? I can't see you. That, like, where are you? There you are. That, or my, my fingers. That's her hiss. And then, obviously, Maid Marion. Or they just call her. You know, they call her Maid Marian. Um, it's pretty cool. Robin's played by Brian Bedford. Um, it's a very charming voice. He's in Nixon, he's in Grand Prix. Porn's being earnest, wow. Is he still alive? No, he died last year. Um, but he's pretty cool. Like, he's very, very. Oh! He was in Cheers. That's a different British dude, I think a lot of people think, but he was in Cheers. Um. Yeah, and it's kind of like the rich and the poor, and there's this scene, this really sad scene with the little kids who are rabbits and turtles and things. And, like, it's a birthday, and the sheriff comes to, to take the taxes, and this kid, it's his birthday, and he, he he's a rabbit, and he, he, he dresses like Robin. And, like, the sheriff takes his birthday money, and that's all they have. And it's, just, it's a wonderful, like, well, that's not wonderful, but, like, it makes you care a lot, even if you know the story. I haven't seen the old ones. I've not seen Errol, F Errol Flynn. 
did Robin Hood, right? Or is that Douglas Fairbanks? They probably both did it. I know Douglas Fairbanks did pirate stuff. But they probably both did Robin Hood. Um, and so it's that in, like, Robin and Marion aren't really together. They like each other, but they're not together. And they do get together. And, you know, there's been comments of being like, oh, they use the animation, the same, whatever. Who cares? Like, really? Like, some scenes they have to use the same animation because there's not enough money or time for it. The Disney went through a rough patch for a while. Um, they, I don't even know if they get married. I think they get married. And they do the contest and robbing this prison and then getting him out of prison. If you know Robin Hood, like any basic story, most of them do the same thing. Um, I've never seen, um, excuse me, um, Robin Hood, Prince of Thieves. I've seen part, parts of it, um, but I haven't seen it in its full entirety. I, I know a scene that Eleanor think it's really bad. It says something about eating your heart out with a spoon and canceling Christmas, which makes me laugh a lot. Um, but I, I need to check that out. I just haven't gotten around to it. But yeah, it's just, it's simple, it's sweet. Um, I do love the song, which I'm gonna play a second of. That everybody knows. I'm, I'm literally playing the, 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 Everybody knows this song, right? Oh no, this is the wrong one. What's it called? I love this song. I actually have the song on my iPod. It's just very... It's very, uh... Robin Hood and Little John walking through the forest Laughing back and forth at what the other has to say That one's good, and then there's this one if you don't know this too, something's wrong. I'll cancel because I don't know the copyright things on here. <coughs> Sorry. Um, I have that song on my iPod, which is also the Robin Hood Earl John song. In the movie, um, that guy's voice, who I don't know who he is, though. <sighs> Roger Miller. He sounds very familiar. Is he a musician? Yeah, he was a musician. Oh, King, he wrote King of the Road. That's cool. Chuggalug. That's pretty cool. I don't really. I, his name sounds familiar. But it's Alan Aldale. That's the character. He's never named. He's kind of the narrator of the movie. Um, but yeah, it's cute. Um, and it's underrated in Disney. Like, it's really underrated. Not that many people remember it. Which is sad. Because it's not like they're like. It's going to blow everybody's mind away. But it's enjoyable. It's kind of the same levelish of a sword in the stone, like unless that's your favorite Disney movie. Um, but again, like I said, most of them, the animal ones, really always got to me. Like I just go mine, mine. Um, so this was kind of perfect. Like I loved Peter Pan too, obviously. I don't know what I said last time, but um. Sorry, I just want to look here. And it's really cool that they do the whole two discs. Because I still like DVDs. Um, but yeah. <coughs> Sorry. Writer. Composer. So, I'm going to look up more about him because he seems cool. Okay, I'm going to stop and... I kind of energy back from coughing, which is really weird. Um, 
And the next one is not a Disney movie. Hooray. The next two aren't Disney movies, and then everything else. I only have six more. And then I'm done with my animation. I don't have any more animation. And I'm going to start on... I haven't decided yet if I'm going to stick, because a lot of my movies are multiple genres. Um, chick flicks, because I don't got that many. Okay.